many a talented persons have gone unnoticed and the world never had a chance to be exposed to their talent because that person did not take the time to begin to express or to demonstrate or to motivate themselves in the direction to bring that which they came into the universe to bring. How can you measure your motivation? How can you evaluate where you are on a scale of one to 10? How do you rate yourself from one to 10? Your mental attitude about yourself, how you feel about you, how you feel about life. How do you rate yourself on a scale of one to 10? in terms of your physical appearance, in terms of your health? Do you take care of yourself? Are you allowing yourself to get overweight and out of shape? Are you conscious of your health? Are you watching the food that you take into your body? What contribution are you giving? What will you leave? What will be different because you came this way? Someone once said that life is our gift to us that God has given us and how we live our lives is our gift to God. What kind of gift are you formulating? One of the things that we must do is that we must be involved in working on achieving self-mastery. You must work on yourself continuously. Never be satisfied with yourself. Always know that as you invest the effort and time on you, that's the greatest ability that human beings have above animals. See, a dog can't be anything but a dog. A tree can't be anything but a tree. Human being, you've got unlimited potential. You can put effort on you, and by concentrating on you and developing you, you can transform your life wherever you are right now. And as you continue to work on yourself, you will begin to expand your vision of yourself. You begin to work towards self-mastery. And you will begin to see it reflect itself in all the dimensions of your life, your mental life, your physical life, your social life, in your relationship, your monetary life. So concentrate on developing yourself. See, you can't feel well and do well if you don't have good health. You can't perform if you don't have your health. Your health is valuable. Develop a health plan, a plan that you will follow because this is the only vehicle that you have to carry you through this experience called life. What will make you happy? You need to know, you need to start asking yourself some questions. What do I really, really, truly want? And knowing that all is well, seeing yourself in control and in charge of your destiny, being healthy and happy. That's why it's important for you to work on yourself, listening to tapes, building yourself up, talking to yourself with power, feeling and conviction, building yourself up day in and day out because it's coming. You want to develop technical mastery. You want to be the best at what you do. You want to master it. See, part of, of, of self-motivation is you've got to find something that gives you a strong sense of competence. Well, you become known for that. You develop a reputation of being good at doing that. You want to live life with energy and passion. You want to be happy. you got a lot to be thankful for. What do I want out of life? What do you want out of life?